General Motors knows a thing or two about recalls, of course, after faulty ignition switches linked to more than two dozen fatalities led to the recall of millions of autos and billions in costs last year. And that was all just in the first year for the new CEO, Mary Barra. Shares of General Motors over that year are down about 10 percent. So what's Ms. Barra's outlook for 2015? Phil LeBeau has that story. For those of us who have dedicated our lives to this company, it is enormously painful to have our shortcomings laid out so vividly. After a scandal-filled 2014 that included defending General Motors on Capitol Hill, CEO Mary Barra believes her company has changed for the better. I hope you see that GM is what I feel moving in a very positive direction and we're getting to the core with the right products, the right brands and making the right decisions. And I think you know me well enough now with all the time we had the opportunity to talk last year that I'm a very results oriented person. Getting by is not my idea of winning and I also hate excuses. Barra admits there's no excuse for GM waiting years to recall millions of defective vehicles. But despite a year of negative headlines, GM sales last year actually increased by more than 5%. And despite its market share edging to an all-time low, GM is still number one in the U.S. Market watchers believe Barra has weathered the storm that rocked GM in 2014. It does seem like she has made a lot of the right moves. It seems like she has shown that they still have a commitment to customers. They still want, you know, want to do the right thing. She admitted her mistake, which is, I think, really big. I mean, companies have a hard time doing that. Cheap gas and America's renewed love for trucks and SUVs helps General Motors, which has a strong lineup in those categories, and overall is selling vehicles at record high prices. As for the rest of this year, Barra expects industry sales to continue growing. In the U.S., we expect continued um, steady growth in the industry, and we believe it's going to come in somewhere between 16.5 million and 17 million units. And, you know, if you had to say pinpoint it, probably right uh, in the middle of that range. The real test for 2015, can Mary Barra grow General Motors' bottom line? As Barra herself said today, profitable growth is one of her top priorities. Phil LeBeau, Nightly Business Report, Detroit.